What do you guys think? In my book, love is a force that shouldn't be played with. The essence will never bring real love or joy to anyone. I think we should destroy every last drop of it. Nonsense! How could you destroy such a treasure? Bruh, do you remember what it did to you? The essence is hope in a bottle. It's precious. Love doesn't come as easy to me as it does to others. So you basically want to spray it on me so I'll love you. I need all the help I can get, and I'm not the only one. I really should choose him next time. Miss Princess, what is your take on love? Are you a pragmatic like me or a fatal romantic like TJ? You're looking at love the wrong way, Raphael. Raphael didn't like that. Well, I'm sorry. You don't think people need help expressing the feelings? Everyone needs to learn to express love in their own way. True love transcends all else. It can't be forced. Well, I must say I'm an old school romantic myself. The world is in a bad way, but love will prevail in the end. Love is the only thing that makes me hope for a future. I put my money on intelligence any day of the week. Romantics think everything has to be perfect. The first meeting, the first kiss, the first night. Only the results should count, finding your soulmate. You can't just engineer your way to finding your soulmate. Pfft, trust me, I've been trying. Nostalgia. Do you remember meeting in Notre Dame? Wasn't it perfect? It was like a dream. It was a setup, remember? Yeah, it was a dream. It's great. I loved it, really. I love how we're talking like an old married couple. It was perfect, TJ, and it couldn't have been more romantic. Hmm. TJ liked that. I did too, TJ. I'm glad you think so too. You look so beautiful in the light of a stained glass. Oh, give me a break. Oh, did I just say that out loud? We've been walking for a long time. Do you think we're near? Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I was so... Mm -hmm. Yeah, I can see the end of the tunnel. And this seems like the perfect place to set up a secret lab. Keep an eye out for concealed doors or hatches. Don't worry, if there's a door here, we'll find it. I really hope we haven't come all this way for nothing. But take a look at this, it's a lever of some kind. Good job, Raphael, this looks promising. Pull the lever. Oh boy, laboratory, we've found the lab. This is it, Vincent's secret laboratory. Or laboratory? I don't know. I'll probably say both. Shady secret of Sinister. Just like Vincent. Yeah, but he's really pushing the whole mad professor thing. I wonder how many hours he spent down here experimenting. Let's just hope we don't find any dead bodies. To be fair, the place does have a certain charm. <sighs> Are you joking? This room gives me the creeps. It certainly is unique. I love it. I can't wait to get out. There's a dark and ominous presence at work here. Let's just do what we came for and be on our merry way. What do you say we search the lab? TJ, you take the right side. Raphael, you take the left. What am I going to do? The first one to find the essence gets the girl. Oh, God. I don't like that. Is he joking? I think so. Yes, Raphael. I'm pretty sure he is. Hmm. I never really was good at playing hide and seek. Who should decide what happens if we find the essence? I should decide what to do. They should decide. They should decide. I don't care. I really don't care. <laughs> Who am I to decide what to do with such a major discovery? Maybe we should all vote and let democracy do its thing? 
I found the essence. It's over here. There's only a small flask of it. Vincent must have distilled the source into a concentrate. But that's still probably enough to make gallons of perfume. We have to get rid of it now. Let's find a drain. The drain? That's not a bad idea. No, don't do that, please. Just stop and think for a second. If you destroy the essence, there's no going back. Think about all the people whose life you could change. <sighs> Don't listen to him, Nostalgia. Listen to your gut. Listen to your head. The essence can help mankind. It all comes down to what I decide. So what should I do? Side with Raphael and keep it. Side with TJ and destroyed it. I'm sorry, we're destroying this. I'm surprised that Raphael doesn't want to destroy it after he got drugged. Like, legit, I had to lie to him because he got drugged. TJ's right, the essence has to be destroyed. No, you can't do this. You'll rob thousands of people of a chance to be happy. But you wouldn't have been happy, my dude. How happy were you that I was lying to you just to keep you, like... Like, you literally wanted to jump off the top of the Eiffel Tower. Literally. I think you might be overreacting. Save your breath, Raphael. I've made up my mind. Damn, I don't need to be mean, though. He's the reason why I'm here. <laughs> like, damn you, TJ. This is all your fault. My fault. Your romantic views have led to an irreparable catastrophe. Because of you, she's making the worst mistake of her life. Dude, it literally had to do with you getting drugged. Like, and I'm sorry, but you drinking the essence didn't make you any more attractive to me. And I would have fallen in love with you for the wrong reasons if I would have drank the essence to fall in love with you. TJ had nothing to do with this. Well, thanks for the vote of confidence. Do you think I can't make up my mind on my own? I'm just so disappointed in you. I'm disappointed in you. You brought me to Paris under false pretenses, my dude. Like, you've been lying to me from the very start. I really expected you to be smarter than this. Come on, Raphael, don't leave. I'm sorry, I know he's a good friend of yours. I don't want to call him a friend, honestly. Never would have called him a friend. Are you really sorry? No, I'm not really. You know I never liked the guy. But did I really convince you to destroy the essence? Kind of. I made up my mind on my own. Like, damn, guys. I'm not stupid. You brought me to Paris for a reason. I still don't understand why, but you brought me here for a reason. Sorry, me meanwhile, I'm also at work. Okay. I'm a journalist, remember? I always make up my mind for myself. And I'm never swayed by people's opinion. Well, it doesn't matter why you did it. You did the right thing. I know I did. I would trust you with my life any day. Aw. Thanks, that's sweet, TJ. <clears throat> Sorry, thanks, that's sweet, TJ. Hmm. Can we get the fuck out of here? So are we destroying this essence or not? Can we get the fuck out of here? Let me take care of it. I'll meet you outside. Vincent's gonna catch me in here. And he's gonna kill me. Seriously, how's Raphael gonna feel once I'm killed by Vincent? Okay, there must be a drain around here somewhere. Destroy the essence and leave. I feel like if I pour it down the drain, it's gonna get into the water of Paris and people are just gonna like be intoxicated just from smelling its like aroma in the river. I wonder where Raphael went. I hope he's okay. I would say he'll be all right, but I don't really think that. There they are. Don't let them get away. Block the exit and shoot them if they make a run for it. I see you're up to your old tricks, Miss Princess. What? <laughs> Can't a girl walk the sewers in peace? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I need to change this. What? Can't a girl walk the sewers in peace? Not my sewers.
If you hurt her, it's going to get ugly. Spare me the testosterone rush and return what is mine, now. Come and get it. What would that be? We've destroyed it. Come and get it. Come and get it. Why don't you stop hiding behind your bodyguards and get your perfectly manicured hands dirty for a change? You're boring me, Miss Princess. I don't care. You bore me. Ever since I met you, you've bored me. I hated your office. I hate your play. I don't hate his play. I just really hate that he kidnapped my friend and then made me watch a play instead of just telling me outright. This charade is getting old and my patience is spent. I think I'll have you both executed. Just for kicks. And then I'll retrieve the essence from your cold, dead hand. Aren't you tired of bullying people everywhere you go? <laughs> I think he likes it. I think the answer is in the question. <sighs> Drop the act, Vincent. Your cynicism is as fake as your hair. He has fake hair? You can fool your goons. I see right through you. TJ has tried to provoke him so I can get a chance to flee. I could never leave TJ behind. I'm out of here. I can never leave TJ behind. Sorry. We did this together. And Americans stick together. <laughs> I don't know. How could I even think of running for my life? We're in this together. If TJ dies, so shall I. Mm -hmm. Ha! You think making me mad will save your little lovebird? <sighs> uh... <laughs> Oops, sorry for spoiling your desperate romantic climax. Bruh, I already told you that I like you. Like, I'm sorry, but if I told you that I like you, you can tell me that you like me, if you like me. But I am a good sport. Any final words before I drop the X? Yes, I have something to say to nostalgia. Oh, this is going to be fun. I've lied to you in the past, but this is the whole truth. I love you, Nostalgia. I love you, too. <laughs> Awkward. I love you, too. You know, I've only been here for a little while, but I love you. You're, you're, you're chill. I love you, too, TJ. Hmm. TJ liked that. Good. I'm glad you liked that. <laughs> this has to be the best moment of my life. I love that I give him a monotone voice for that. <laughs> And your last. If it is, I'll die a happy man. Who said anything about dying? Oh, Raphael's still in the sewers. That's great. Raphael? What are you doing here? Seriously, I thought you pieced it because he got butt hurt. Miss Princess, you've got to leave here now. I've opened the valves. Hurry! <laughs> hurry, hurry, hurry! The whole pl the entire place will soon be underwater! Guard, secure a way out. And let me go first. I hope Vincent dies. Quick, climb on my shoulders. It'll buy you some time. Oh, you could just come with me to the nearest exit! Raphael, you came back to save us. Can we please leave? Just come! Before the water drowns us all. The man makes a good point. Hurry, nostalgia. Escape! With an exclamation mark. Wow, that was a close call. For a second, I didn't think we were going to make it out. Miss Princess, are you all right? See, you still can't even call me Nostalgia, dude. What's that going to be like in bed? Yes, thank you. Thanks to you. You saved our lives, Raphael. <laughs> you saved out lives, Raphael. When I saw Vincent and his goons closing in... Get that man. He's the one behind all of this. Excuse me? I decided to call the police and tell them everything. Get your hands off me. I thought he owned the police, though. But I guess, like, when you're 
drugging a whole country that changes things? Nice try. You're coming with us. If you can't respect me, at least respect my suit. As you've probably heard, my presence is required elsewhere. Yeah, jail. Get the fuck out. Bye. You might have won this round, but the game is still on. This might be the last time I see him. What should I say? I love you, Vincent. You know, I kind of liked you. Why are you so evil? Need some essence for prison? What makes you tick, Vincent? Why are you so evil? Like, why, bruh? Why? With your power, you could have done so much good in the world, and you just fucking didn't. Why do you insist on being so evil all the time? Villains have always been my favorite characters, Miss Princess. I mean, same, but that doesn't mean I'm gonna become one. Like, dude, I love Dr. Facilier. <laughs> He's my favorite Disney villain ever. That's enough, Miss... <laughs> That's enough, Mcom. Take him away. That's my cue, but remember, this is just an au revoir. Okay, bye. Au revoir, Vincent. Hope you get a butch cellmate. Oh, damn. That's... That's, that's a yikes. <laughs> we finally managed to crutch that awful leech for good. So what will you do now, Raphael? Re reinstate City of Love. Now go to City of Love and get the place back on its feet. Well done, dude. Proud of you. I sure hope you do. Thanks again for your help. And, you know... Thanks for luring me here under false pretenses and helping me find another American. <laughs> no, thank you, Miss Nostalgia. I'll never forget you. Better not. I have strange feeling we'll meet again someday. I have strange feeling we'll meet again someday. I guess this is goodbye too. What the fuck, dude? So wait, hold on. Hold on a second. So when you're in a state of panic, you tell me that you're moving back to the States and that you want me to come with me. Then we're in an almost death situation and you tell me you love me. And now all of a sudden, now that everything is okay, now you're just like, well, I guess goodbye. Like, what the hell? Literally, this reminds me of like, I literally said this earlier about like how I've dated guys in the past where it's just like something casual and then they decide to make it something serious and then once it becomes serious, they peace. It's like, what? This was your idea. It was all your idea. Thank you for destroying the essence and for trusting me. Well, I don't fucking trust you anymore. About that, I actually kept a few drops. What? A part of me still wants to try it out, you see. Why don't we try it together? I'll throw it away. Let's try it together. Because apparently fucking love isn't enough. Like, are you telling me that you love me isn't enough? Why don't we drink it together? Just you and me. Success, TJ likes you enough. Great, we're gonna have the best passion of sex of our lives. How could I refuse an offer like that? Souvenir unlocked. Alright, let's get high. High off of love. Presh. Absolutely presh. It's such a shame you're leaving Paris. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm not going with him. If you want to come home with me, my offer still stands. Dude, after all of this, I'm not going to be with him. He's just going to abandon me. Well, I should get going. I've got a lot of packing to do. I understand, TJ. Good luck, and I'll miss you. Well, I guess that's it. The essence has been found. Vincent's in jail, and Paris gets to live another day. What should I do with myself now? Drink wine, explore the city, move on, find love. I fucking love that, dude. You guys, I literally just told you that this is what guys I'm into fucking do. They literally, like... They, TJ didn't have to tell me he loves me. And now he just fucking left to go to America? He's like, my offer still stands. Why don't I want to go with him? I told him I love him too. I'm over it. Explore the city. I don't fucking give a shit anymore. With all this drama, I've never gotten around to touring Paris. 
And there's still so much to see, it makes my head spin. Life is too short for regrets and second thoughts. If I've learned anything from this crazy adventure, it's not really what you do in life that matters. But who you do it with. Yeah, but he just left to go to America. Deep down, I know what I want. I know who I really want. If I let this pass me by, Paris will never forgive me. Sometime later. This is ridiculous. Eiffel Tower. Was this my first time here? Only a few weeks have passed, but it seems like years. It's strange how fast things can get normal again. It's a perfectly nice day. Paris is a wonderful place. And I'm about to spend time with my favorite person. That person who was on my mind for so long. The lovely Raphael TJ Louise cat. TJ. How fucking dare you leave? Did you finish packing, motherfucker? It's been a few weeks, but so much... But things have changed so much. There you are, sweet pea. Hey, sweetie, you're looking dashing. As usual. Oops. You know this is my lucky suit. I'll never change it. So, are we good to go? I think so. I've said my goodbyes. Okay, so I am going to America. And I've wandered around my favorite Parisian haunts. Hmm. So you won't regret leaving Paris with me? No, not at all, sir. I'll miss it, but I feel it's time to move on. The real question, the real questions, is what we'll do in the States. I can think of a couple of things. We gonna bang? What do you say we travel the country? That's good, too. <laughs> you could write articles on the road. For who? And I could get some new ideas for my next collection. That seems more plausible. Sounds like fun. And I'm sure Gina will love life on the open road. We're taking the cat with us. I love that. Hmm. It's a plan. Goodbye, city of love. Onwards to America. Goodbye, Paris. I wonder what I'll miss most about you. The beautiful locations, the people I met, the choices I had to make. <laughs> Nothing. You know what? I'm sorry. Nothing. <laughs> Obviously, I don't mean that, but <laughs> I've just had enough. Actually, I'm looking forward to moving on with my life. Our little Parisian adventure was certainly special. But this is a new chapter. Will Louise get together with Raphael finally? I can't wait to see what the future has in store for us. Oh no. Vincent? How did you get a phone in prison? Trust me, Beast Princess, you don't want to know the details. But I'm calling on a matter of utmost urgency. Something has come up. And I'm afraid I need your help. Excuse me? What? I'm so confused. I thought we were done. I thought we were done with City of Love. What the fuck is going to happen now? Okay. Season 2, Episode 1. Apparently, this is happening. <laughs>